I love to smell good. So this kind of video makes me so happy. <laughs> also put this on the armpit, on my elbows, on my knees, behind my thighs, on the groin, in the crack. I mean, we can do all of it. I know my skin. Let's talk about it, okay? Welcome to my bathroom. <laughs> Let's talk all of my favorite body products to get that smooth, clear skin because it's the new year and we wanna revitalize, rejuvenate ourselves and work on all the areas that matter to us and our skin is one of them, hello? That's why you're here. So if you're not already subscribed, make sure you do that. Mena underscore Adibia on IG and also follow me on TikTok. All the links to all products that I'm gonna mention today are gonna be below. So take a look at that in case you wanna pick up anything that I mentioned. Now, I can share so many items, but I had to narrow it down, okay? There are so many things that I wanna try and there are a few things that I already have tried that I love, so let's go through them. When it comes to skin, Okay, if you have brown skin, or any skin at all, honestly, but let's talk about brown skin, okay? Then you probably have darkness on your knees, darkness on your elbows. Let's see, mine have lightened up. This is a scar from when I was a child, but mine have lightened up considerably, okay? You might have keratosis pilaris, which is that strawberry skin, little, little bumps. I have a little bit right here in my elbow and not so, mm, fairly a little bit of on this side. I get it behind my thighs, and then you might have darkness on your knees, darkness on your ankles, whatever the case is, right? Let's say that you have back knee, okay? Acne on your back. These are all blemishes on the skin that are pesky and irritating. So here are some products that I recommend for you. All the ones that I'm mentioning right now are all products that you should use in the evening time. Or if you do it in the morning time, make sure you don't have anywhere to go because you wanna stay out of the sun with these products. Do not use any of these products when you're out on a vacation or a planning to go on a vacation in a few days. Give your skin some time to rejuvenate. You feel what I'm saying? Let's talk topicals, cause they do want a daggone thing, okay? They have the under eye brightening patches, which are all the rave, all kinds of viral. I wanna use them, but I don't because I don't have darkness. So I don't want to lighten up my skin unnecessarily and then look crazy. So that's why I don't use that. But I have been enjoying this Slather Exfoliating Body Serum from Topicals. Now this is an exfoliating body serum. You put this on after you have showered. And I've used this without a lotion on top because somehow, some way, this is still hydrating. It's going to speed up the skin cell turnover. What does that mean? It's going to speed up the shedding of our skin. The dust you have in your house, not just powder from your makeup when you do your makeup in the morning, honey, it's dead skin cells, okay? It's dust from fabrics. Thinking about that is so disgusting, isn't it? Either way, we gotta get that dead skin off, you feel me? Because underneath it is nice, smooth, even skin, okay? So this product is good. It has retinol in it. If you don't already know, retinol is great for the face. The skin on our face is a lot thinner than the skin on our body, so products will permeate our face a lot faster and work a lot quicker, <laughs> work a lot quicker on the face than the body. But when you think about a body product that has retinol in it, you're in the money because it's going to work. And I like to put this all over the body, honey, all over, all right? We want the groin area to be smooth and even as well as our legs, our calves, our shoulders, the whole shindig, you feel me? So it has retinol, lactic acid, urea, and squalene. So it's gonna hydrate, like I said, I put this on by itself and then put on my pajamas and go on to bed and I felt fine, but of course you can and let this dry, it'll feel like, it'll feel hydrated, it'll feel wet, okay? Let it absorb into the skin, and then if you want to, lotion on top, you can do that. This is great, it says to use it two to three times a week, max, okay? That's giving every other day. And you wanna start off slow, and you can use it more often as your skin tolerates it. You can use this as a spot treatment if you wanted to, so let's say behind the thighs, on the buttock if you have butt acne, back knee, elbows, but just do the whole body, even the feet. You know I don't get pedicures often because I use any number of these products all over the body, even the feet, so I'm continually getting off the dead skin. It's a lifestyle, okay? This is something that we just, we do on a rotating basis, all right? Another option is from Skin Fix, and this is their resurfacing KP and PSO smoothing body treatment. Again, KP is keratosis pilaris, which is the strawberry skin, which is, again, those bumps. What it is is dead skin that is built up into them little beady beads, and we don't want that. It's it don't even feel good, you feel me? I do full body laser. My arm is so smooth right now. I wanna rub it and also get to this part and it still be smooth. I don't need this part if you all bumpy. Mm -mm. We ain't doing that, okay? So again, this is a good product. Also a serum. It's not gonna be thick like a lotion. It's a serum. This will dry into the skin. Whenever I use this, I don't put lotion on top either. I just go, I just do this and go to bed. I have used this on my feet only sometimes. You really can do it how you feel. If, it, if your skin tolerates it, you're not getting breakouts and you're enjoying the results, you skin is feeling smooth, then you can put this all over your body. But if you wanted to use either of these, like 
again, like I mentioned, in certain spots, do that as well. Same thing, avoid direct sun at least till the next day. Use it in the evening time. It's just good stuff. While doing my skincare, I gotta be honest, I will many times put the skincare products from my face onto my body. So this is one of those products, Nip and Fab Exfoliate Glycolic Fix Night Pads. It says extreme, okay? This is for the face. But the skin on our face is the skin on our body. Like, you can still use the same stuff on the body, you feel me? As long as your skin tolerates it. And really and truly, if you have a skincare product that you feel is too strong for your face, put it on the body. Retinol, glycolic acid, which is in this these, these pads, any other item, put on the body. I mean, why waste it, right? So these are pads and I take one of them, it is soaked up with the product, and then I rub it on my face, yes, but I also put this on the armpit, on my elbows, on my knees, behind my thighs, on the groin, and the crack. I mean, we can do all of it. I know my skin. I am not sensitive, so know your skin before you do these things, okay? Don't go and do it and end up with blisters and then come be hollering at me. I don't wanna hear it, I already told you. Go easy with it, okay? My skin is tough. African thick skin, Adesia. So I'm able to tolerate. This thing is almost done, okay? I have used this on my body more than I have used it on my face, that's a fact. So any facial pads work. Even if you had a toner, a glycolic toner, an AHA and or BHA toner, same thing. Get a facial pad like these, soak it, and then wipe the areas. You know my odor eliminating routine includes using products like this on my armpits. I did go too far one time, and there was a stint where my armpit skin was really hmm, sensitive and irritated so I had to scale it back and now I'm being more mindful of how often I'm doing this whether it's a liquid with a cotton pad or this per se or doing the panoxyl in the in the shower either way they all have the BHA AHA product in it that's going to exfoliate the skin lighten up the darkness it's going to clear out the bumps that you have it's like you have those pussy bumps you don't want to be popping them on your armpits this stuff could work barring that it's anything serious you feel what I'm saying this is gonna take care of it and I mean, I've seen great results. And not to mention, like I said, it helps to kill the odor causing bacteria that causes armpit odor, hello. I mean, I use deodorant, but I don't live by it. You feel me? I am mainly doing my process, which includes wiping my armpits with an AHA or BHA pad. Or And, and so glycolic acid is an AHA, an alpha hydroxy acid. Sal salicylic acid is the BHA, beta hydroxy acid. Salicylic acid is a lot stronger than gly glycolic acid. So if you want to go easy and start off slow, then get a glycolic acid product like this one from Nip and Fab. That was a long explanation. I live for explaining because I need you to understand. This stuff is serious and you gotta do it right. And I don't want you to be, you know, over there burning your skin off. You feel what I'm saying? Next, we have this Nurturium Skin Renewing Retinol Body Lotion, okay? So it's gonna give you the hydration and the cell renewal because of the retinol. So this, again, is a product to use two to three times a week. Start off every other day. See how your skin reacts. I advise you to use it in the evening time. You might feel dry maybe itchy, put on some lotion in the morning, you know, do your whole routine, go from there. It is going to speed up the cell turnover, speed up the dead skin coming off, basically, okay? The skin cells turning over, falling off, that's what that means. All right, this one is new, so I haven't made my way through this one very much, but same idea. So I'm, I usually just rotate through these and just go by how I feel, you feel me? I know I have a lot of products, so I do what I can to get through them, but different options in case you wanna try any of these. You can grab the Naturium product from Target, you can go into Sephora and grab Slather and Skin Fix and, and so forth, okay? And another product that I got recently in the mail that I really do enjoy is this Nude Sticks Love Your Body Peptide Body Cream. Yo, I made the mistake of putting this on one morning because it felt so good. My skin was fine, thank God. I mean, I wasn't outside tanning. I don't tan anyway, but I wasn't on a vacation on the beach. You feel what I'm saying? But I do use this in the evening time. It smells so good. It is so creamy. It's heavy in lavender. If you don't like lavender, you're not gonna like this. It smells so stinking good. It is creamy. These products that renew our skin can sometimes make the skin feel dry. What I liked is that this is a body butter that also was doing the renewing. So my skin felt creamy. I mean, it felt greasy in the best way. I've said it many times. Brown skin just looks and feels so good when it's greasy. It needs to shine, okay? The dullness, I'm not doing that. It needs to have a shine to it. You know what I'm saying? I can't do lotion. It's gonna just, 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 I can't do that. It has to, I need to glow. Okay, I need to see the reflection. That's how I know that I've done something. My dad's, yeah. So this is so, so, so good. It has AHA in it, okay? And it's got coconut oil, yuzu, bergamot, and lavender. So it has have a strong scent. If you love scent, you wanna exfoliate, and you wanna hydrate in the evening time, Nude Fix, love your body. 
peptide body cream. This stuff is good. Now, to hydrate the skin, let's go over a few products. Again, this is just a, a small assortment. There could be so many. I don't wanna do too much, but if you want a longer list, let me know in the comments below. By the way, I straightened my hair. <laughs> do you love? Let me know. <laughs> I have been loving this. Natrium is doing it. Susan Yara, I see you girl. Natrium is doing it, okay? The Glow Getter Multi Oil Body Butter. This is my third one. This stuff is so good. It is rich, it leaves a shine, it feels great on the skin. The shine lasts. I don't like those shines that be going away after a while. I need my skin to shine continuously. Hi, what are we here for? I love this. This stuff is just so good. It was sold at one point and I went on the site and I got the, the bundles, so it was a two pack for $36. This stuff is so stinking good. It's oil infused. It deeply conditions and hydrates the skin. It's true. It has glycerin, shea butter, squalane, linoleic rich botanical oils. It has a nice soft scent to it. Oh my gosh. I just can't, I can't talk about this enough. To me, this rivals the Fenty Beauty with Body Butter. I haven't used that one in a while because I've been going through so many different creams. This is so freaking good. I cannot get over it. If you need that hydration, love that hydration, get this. Let's say for instance, you're showering and go to bed and you're like going to bed too sticky, not sticky, but you know, like plump and wet and stuff. Then put this on your feet and then go to bed. It's just one of those products that is gonna, you're guaranteed to feel and see the suppleness of your skin immediately. This is freaking good. We all know and love Sal Janeiro, honey, and they got a new body butter. I saw Jackie on a post about it. I cannot wait to learn more, okay? We all know and love the Beige Floor Elastic Cream. This stuff is fantastic. It smells divine. If I want to smell good and leave my scent in everything, leave it in my clothing, on the bed, in my jacket, I mean, this is the lotion to wear. Do you understand me? My, my, my. I remember Dr. Dre talked about this, the dermatologist, and she hated it because it was so strong. I'm like, girl, you in the wrong business, okay? This is for us, girl, put it down. Mm -mm. Don't, 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 don't be taking these all out. We need these, okay? What I will say that I can't stand about this, though, is that it does not leave a shine on the skin. In fact, it takes a lot of effort to massage into the skin. You take a whole bunch of it, and then when you're rubbing, it's all white, and you gotta be there rubbing and rubbing until it melts in. I can't stand that. I cannot stand that. Salgenetto, please. Okay, well, why? So that's what turns me off about using this, but I know that when I want to smell extremely freaking good and my skin will feel soft too, I know to use this. This I will always buy because of the scent. I really do wish that it would absorb into the skin easier because that is irritating. But I still recommend this. I still do, because you want to smell good? Girl, this is it. Another body butter, baby, because listen, we gonna make our skin nice and smooth and we gonna hydrate and smell good. Do you understand me? Fenty Eau de Parfum body butter, baby. The Eau de Parfum body butter. Let's talk about it. I understand why some might feel like the Eau de Parfum, the fragrance, don't smell good. It's a bold, polarizing fragrance. One that I would not say is a good blind buy, meaning I wouldn't encourage you to buy it without ever smelling it. However, you know me, and I love a bold, strong, commanding scent. Look, I just opened it, and the, oh. Nah, yeah, nah, that just, I just got pissed off. I got pissed off because this is so good. Okay, I just got upset because this is so good. Look, it's almost done. When it was sent to me, I went online and it was sold out. I found that's four at Kohl's. I bought another one and that's just in the stash. I've been taking my time with this because it's so good. I don't wanna finish it, isn't that annoying? This is glass, it's heavy, it feels expensive, it feels luxurious. On the skin, the way that it leaves the oil behind, it does remind me of that Naturium body butter as well. It just leaves that oil. It feels like you rubbed an oil onto your skin, but not not an oil because a lot of times the oils, if you put just oil on your skin, it'll feel like it's on top of your skin. And this is absorbing into the skin, leaving the oil on top. The scent is strong and pronounced. Girl, if you love a pronounced scent, this is it, honey. It's a grown and sexy commanding scent. That's all I'm gonna say about it. And I love the way that it leaves a shine. This is a favorite of mine. Do I sound different explaining this over the Naturium one? I hope I do. I mean, I was dr dramatic on the Naturium one because it's a new product and I, I was blown away. This I've loved for months now. So please don't make it, don't think that like I'm choosing the term over this. Like if I had to choose, okay, fine. If I had to choose between the term and this one, <laughs> I'm gonna go, <sighs> man, that's hard. Because of the strong fragrance, this one. But if I were to choose based on how my skin feels and looks afterward, they're both great, okay? But the fragrance on this one, 
tops it. Another body butter that is affordable, okay, in Target is this one by Beloved. I've worked with Beloved a few times over the past few months, if you've noticed, on social, and this stuff is good. It's at Target, so you can go right inside Target, get your hands on it, very soft, whipped delicious the color of the year is actually peach and this falls right in line with it it's called peach prosecco and mimosa flower vegan body cream with plant-based moisturizers you might sometimes feel like because something's in a drugstore because it's a low price it ain't gonna be good and i've been there i've thought that okay this stuff is hydrating this stuff smells good it melts into the skin in a lovely way like what so this, I mean, I've been digging all up and through this thing, honey. It's almost done. I love how soft it is. It's not thick. It just melts in so quickly. It's not something you have to rub for 10 years to get into your body, you know what I'm saying? This is really, really good. I've enjoyed the body wash. We're not talking about body washes right now. Actually, we are. Hang on. <laughs> I have enjoyed that body wash, so you know, leave that there too. One body wash I do want to talk about because with Naturium and it's an empty is this Naturium. It actually it matches this. Oh, girl, it's the same thing. The Glow Getta Multi Oil Body Wash. Praise God. Mm -hmm. Oil to gel formula, honey. This is the kind of body wash that when you put it on and rinse it off, you might think that there's leftover residue on your body. Excuse me, there is. But I wouldn't call it residue. Residue sounds offensive, you feel me? It's delicious, gentle surfactants plus linoleic rich oils, fermented squalene and glycerin. Girl, listen, okay? When you put conditioner in your hair, the whole point is you wanna nourish your hair. You feel what I'm saying? You wanna replenish what's been lost through the shampoo. And conditioner leaves behind residue on the hair to keep it soft. You feel what I'm saying? The same thing with this. It's leaving something behind in the best way. Yo, the skin feels great. The skin feels great after this. You use this and then you put the body butter on top. Girl, please. Mm -mm. The bed she ain't got nothing on you, honey. Nobody got nothing on you. And that's on grammar, okay? This stuff is good. I've gone through three or four of these. I have it now on subscribe and save through Amazon because it is that stinking good. I love it. We love it. You need it. End of story. It ain't a video unless I talk about my brown sugar bay body oils. Listen, <laughs> this is the kind of body oil you can put on any lotion you have on. Even if you're killing them with Jergens, honey. Go ahead and put your brown sugar bay body oil on. Homegirl got us on almost every popular scent you can think of. This stuff smells so stinking good. I I have put this on when I was in Vegas, actually when it was 120 degrees outside. I put this on with nothing else because it was so hot and I loved the shine and the scent that it gave me. But now that I'm back in more civilized weather, <laughs> I will lotion my body, even the strongest body butter cream, I don't care. And I'll go ahead and put this on top because one thing I'm not gonna do is skimp on the scent. We gonna mix all of it together, you feel me? This one right here is Madam. There are lots of different ones. Wild Card is a Classic dupe for Baccarat Rouge 540. You've got Unicorn Essence. I mean, there are so many. I have a lot of them, okay? I have a lot of them. Which one do I recommend? All of them. <laughs> On the site, you'll actually see what each is a dupe for, and then you can make your decision that way. This stuff is good, nice and shiny, adds onto the skin. Just imagine, you have exfoliated your skin. Then you have moisturized your skin. Now you're going to come and scent your skin with the Brown Sugar Babe Nourishen Body Oil. Jai, mm -mm. They can't handle it, they can't handle it. Mm -mm. Ain't no one gonna be able to handle it. And what I love is when you do all these things, then the scent is lasting. The, the scent is going and going, you feel me? You start looking 2024 real good. You feel what I'm saying? I'm just trying to let you know. So I'm gonna link all the products below. As you can tell, I'm hyped because I love to smell good. So this kind of video makes me so happy. <laughs> Listen, let me know what you plan on getting or let me know what you're using that you love. Are you using any kind of products to exfoliate that you like, that are working for you? Let me know. Looking into my shower, I also enjoy the First A Beauty KP Bump Eraser. I'm so annoyed that's an in-shower product. Listen, the list goes on and on and on. The list goes on and on and on. I don't, wanna, I don't wanna choke you too much, but let me know what you're liking and loving because I'd love some suggestions. I'm making my way through what I have. I have some other ones that I wanna try. It's a lot, but all in all, we wanna make sure our skin is soft supple, and it smells good, honey. Make sure you follow me on all socials, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.